Last year, Andrew Ferguson began a new career as a math substitute teacher at San Francisco's Lowell High School. 32 years as a consulting actuary, and I wanted to do something else. I wanted to give something back. If there are any p retired folks out there who are still interested in being part of a workforce and would be interested in being an educator in a classroom, we would love to have you now. That's the message being put out by the San Francisco Unified School District. As of last week, they have filled 75% of the nearly 500 classroom vacancies. We're at about 135 teacher vacancies at this moment, um, and we are 100% committed to having a teacher in every classroom. There are many reasons why they've had so many vacancies. More teachers than they had anticipated retired. Past layoffs have dissuaded young candidates from applying, and then there's the cost of living. The cost of housing in San Francisco is, is not our friend. Many school districts around the Bay Area face the same problem and have come up with creative solutions. Mount Diablo is offering signing bonuses, $5,000 for science, math, and bilingual educators, and $10,000 for special education teachers. Oakland is asking parents to encourage people within their network or on social media to apply for a teaching position. San Francisco is considering buying ads on Muni, and they want people to know that you don't need a credential to teach. If people come with that situation, we'll get them set up with earning their credential along the way. You won't have a better psychic reward than seeing the kids uh, appreciate what you're doing and you helping them along. Teaching jobs in San Francisco can be found at careers.sfusd.edu. In San Francisco, Leanne Melendez, ABC 7 News.